Hey everybody, what's going on? It's Mr. Hino with Mr. Hino's LEGO Robotics. Today's video is going to be about a scaled down version of the Warbot competition. I'll put a link at the end of this video of the Robotics 2 um, Warbot competition that we had a couple of weeks ago. But my Robotics 1 students were like, hey, we want to try something like that. So we came up with a scaled down version for them. You're going to have to check this out. And after watching this video, if you like what you see, go ahead and hit that subscribe button right there. Come on, I know you can do it. So the only difference between the Robotics 1 and Robotics 2 Warbot competition is the Robotics 1 uh, competition is going to be programmed. The Robotics 2, they were using the Commander app to control their robot. Um, the Robotics 1, they're going to be using their program to do the same kind of objective of knocking over those pillars. So let's go to the table and check this out. Okay, so we have our regular FLL table here, kind of like the one that uh, I do most of my competitions on, um, but we're using that one for uh, competition. So I'm using this one here for the Warbot Robotics One competition. So if you notice, the pillars are set up in the same way. You still have your middle line here. <laughs> we just use tissue boxes. One day we're gonna have to just come up with an official like wooden centerpiece right there. So on this one here, the rules are kind of simple and similar to the other Warbot competition we had. Um, each team, and we're going to probably just do a 1v1 on this one here. I think it might get crazy if we try to involve too many teams. Um, but their robot needs, some part of their robot needs to be behind that line when they launch their robot. And then their robot will be programmed to come up as far as they can without hitting this middle point and to launch their projectiles over to knock over as many of the opponent's pillars. Um, we also had a rule on their projectiles. Whatever they project over cannot be over four inches long. We want to kind of make this competitive and not have somebody have this giant uh, projectile to throw over and knock everything over at once and their program is basically going to I mean if they can launch from this back line that would be amazing but most students so they're gonna come up as far as they can and then launch and then their program will have their robot come back and they can basically move their robot anywhere they want on this line obviously they're gonna not want to hit over their own pillar if they do that is going to count against them. And obviously the team that knocks over the most will win. Um, we will put a three minute time limit on this. So if uh, whoever after three minutes uh, has the most knocked over wins. And if we get into a tie, then we have a shootout. Basically how do we handle a shootout is we will flip a coin. If the team wins, they'll get one chance to knock over um, a pillar if they do they win we'll just keep going back and forth until a team knocks over that so let me go ahead and demonstrate what this uh, program will look like so my goal here is to knock over one of theirs and try not to knock over one of mine so here we go Ooh, I didn't even see that happen I it somehow rolled and knocked that one over so beautiful job. Um, let me see if I can get two over in one shot.
Okay, guys, I think I'm going to stop at one. Double is, I did it once, but I wasn't filming, so that's going to be it for today. Wait a second. Mr. Hino doesn't quit. Let's do this. Yeah, double shot. And I didn't knock over any of mine. Gotta love that. Okay, guys, there you have it. The Robotics One Programmable Warbot Competition. Hopefully you liked it. Um, it seems a lot tougher than I thought. I was giving it multiple tries and I wasn't getting stuff knocked over all the time. So um, I don't know if it was the way I was lining it up. Who knows? But anyway, hopefully you guys liked it. Give it a shot. Let me know if it goes well with you guys, okay? I am Mr. Hino from Mr. Hino's LEGO Robotics. I will catch you guys tomorrow. I'm out.